Chief Architect can create a variety of stair styles and ramps, including straight, split, multi-platform, and curved. Stairs are created from the floor below to the floor above. In a split-screen view, I'll place a set of straight stairs on floor 1. With the first stair tool, I can click and drag to draw a specific number of stair treads. You can open these stairs and use the Make Best Fit, and they will automatically span to the next platform. There is another stair tool where you can click and place a set of stairs that automatically spans the platforms for you. There are specific curved stair tools. You can also curb an existing set of straight stairs by using the right mouse button. Stairs can automatically generate a stairwell by clicking on the stair, then using the Auto Stairwell tool to create what's called an open to below room on the floor above. Chief Architect has L-shaped and U-shaped stair tools that work similarly. For this plan, I'll use the L-shaped stairs. You can choose options for the direction and a winder style split landing. With the stairs selected, I'll create a stairwell and then move up to the second floor and make the opening larger. Then in 3D, I'll maximize the view and move up to the second floor. Like all of the architectural objects in Chief Architect, there is complete flexibility to customize the stairs' attributes. Length, number of treads, riser height, winders, railing styles, stringers, balusters, and much more. It's easy to add a starter tread and a flare to any staircase. I'll want a detail to show the stair headroom. Using the back-clipped cross-section camera, I'll create a small section. I'll draw a line parallel to the nose of the stair treads and draw a line that intersects it. With the end-to-end -end dimension, I'll draw from the ceiling platform to the line to create the headroom dimension. The program has over 500 CAD details, including a stair detail, I can place from the library. You can unblock and modify this stair detail, customize to your building needs, and save it back to the library. With text and annotations, you can complete the section view, like I have in this final layout page. The ramp tool works just like the stairs, with ADA-compliant defaults using a 1 in 12 pitch, or any pitch you define.